Hello, in this tutorial we will learn how to align buttons vertically and horizontally in Thunkable. So let's just start. Uh, so I'm going to the button app firstly. Here it is. I have done nothing in it. So let's uh, let me tell you. So first I will add three buttons over here. So first button, second button and then I will add the third button. You add the button on the screen or over here, it doesn't matter. Now we have three bu uh, buttons over here. Now what we'll do is I want a little bit space between these buttons. So what I will do, I will use the margin option. So first I will click on this. I want it to be a little bit up. So what I will do from bottom, I want it to be 20. If you if you will write 20, it will go this much. If you are supposed to write 10, it will go this much. It's your choice, whatever you want to do. Same with this button I, uh, I want to do. So 10, this is how you can add space. Next, if you want that the button should be fully on the screen, what you will do, you will go to the width option and click on fill container on width fill container i will do same with an uh, other also fill container this is how you will do it and if you want a button size height a little bit more what you will do is you will go to relative size and over here you will write suppose i want 20 it will come this much because it's percent i want 10 it will come this much so five if you write five that will come that much so it depends on the choice so let's do this with all 10 10 so that done now uh, if you want to add colors that's very simple go to the button option click on background color click on green if you want green green if you i want this with some reason red and i want uh, specifically purple that's great whatever you want to write let's say i want to write um play play option say pause option and i want a stop option and this is how you can align it if you want the font size to be big you will just write 20 and all this this is how you can add buttons vertically if you want to add pictures in the button what will go uh, what you will do is go to background picture click on it you will click on upload file and then what you will do is you will if you want to go on star you will go on star So this is how you can add uh, all the components in it. Next, let's learn how to horizontally align them. So let me just delete these buttons. Uh, delete. So uh, let me just delete it. I'll delete the whole screen. Now I'll add a new screen. So let me take the background color to be red. Now what, how to horizontally align it is firstly you we will have a column we'll click on column and add a column on the screen and after the column is add we will add a row row so a row also so for horizontally alignment of buttons we need a column and a row after that simply you have to add the buttons So button, I will add three buttons again. One, two, and three. See, it come it uh, it come on the screen horizontally. Why? Because I added columns and rows, so three columns are made, and in rows horizontally they are coming. This is how you can do it. And another option, and another thing is to do is. If I want to add image, so let's see what happens if I add some other specific component. If I add it, it will come here. So 
button should be added in the rows but other components should be added in the columns so it will come like this this is how you can do and other things like we did in vertical uh, in vertically buttons you can change the padding the margin you can change the width and all these components this is how you can create your uh, create your app with buttons aligned vertically and horizontally thank you for watching this video please do like and subscribe my video thank you